guess who's only running a little bit late today? This girl, just a little bit. Um, I'll probably show up at work a few minutes before my shift actually starts. Although, I am limping this morning, so maybe not. We'll see how fast I can walk. My foot's getting really bad. Um, it's, uh, it's, not, it's not fun. And so far, my Nick has told me that she's felt this before and it lasted a good couple of weeks. Kim told me that she felt this before too and it was, uh, no, my Nick was a couple of years, like on and off, and Kim was like a couple of weeks while she was traveling. Same exact thing that I'm, like you feel like your foot is, like there's something broken inside your foot but there isn't, there's no bruising, it's just sensitive to the touch. Same exact thing. So, at least it makes me feel better, I don't feel like it's some sort of weird like foot cancer or something, it's just some sort of weird pain. So I don't know if I should go to the clinic or not, or just ride it out. No idea. I will think about that, but now I gotta go to work. Okay, so I've decided I can't deal with the pain anymore. So I was at work for a couple of hours, and now I'm on my way to the clinic, and I get it looked at, hoping nothing's broken, because the other two people who've had the same problem, Kim and Monique, hasn't been broken. And I didn't do anything, so nothing should be broken. I can't just wake up with a broken foot one morning. That makes no sense. I feel like, if it was broken, you'd be in a lot more pain. That's, that's what, what I think. I thought when it happened to me. But then at the same time, I'm like, I lived with a busted kidney for a very long time. That is true. So, <laughs> and I mean, a broken bone and like a distended kidney is probably not the same, but it hurt a lot. Hopefully my kidneys are okay. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully it's just as long as you have one good one, you're good. That's all that matters. Yeah. But yeah, it just, it really hurts. So anyways. I don't, I don't know what this is going to do to me at work, <laughs> but I have to because I'm going to have to work again tomorrow and then like Tuesday, like it's just, it's, I, the sooner you go the better in case it is something bad, so. <sighs> Update! <laughs> so, got my foot checked for about a minute and a half by a doctor at the clinic and he says it's not broken or he doesn't think it's broken because I haven't done anything that I could break it, so he thinks it's just inflamed. He just sort of poked you a bit. He did. He poked me hard. <laughs> so, I don't know. Yeah, that gave me chills when he poked you and you screamed. Yeah, because it really, like, he found the spot. Because it's literally on the top of my foot. It's this one, like, spot that kills when you touch it or when my foot bends or when I put my boots on or whatever. Walk. It's just this one spot. So, anyways, apparently it's just inflamed even though it doesn't look inflamed he's like you may have just moved something weird and i got a prescription a bunch of pill poppers pill pushers pill pushers is what pushers. they are at the clinic it's not the fun pills though it's just anti-inflammatories boring my brother went to pick up a prescription for someone in the house or himself i have no idea who it was and they got home opened the bag and there was someone else's prescription for like some like pain medication he just hasn't had the chance purpose. to bring it back. Like, what if they did it on purpose? Just like to test people? Test. <laughs> like that movie with Nicolas Cage? What? The movie with Nicolas Cage, Family Man. You haven't seen that movie? Oh, uh, yeah, that movie. But really it's kind of the bad. same thing. Like, the guy at the counter gives, like, change, like, too yeah. much change back and just wants to see how you're going to handle it. That's what makes me afraid. Like anytime anything like that happens, I'm like, I just keep it. I'm like I don't know. It's like that one time I went usually to keep it. And my frozen yogurt was like, I don't know, two or three bucks. I gave the guy a five, and he gave me back a five and other change. And you kept it. You didn't say anything. Well, I wasn't really paying attention. And then as I was walking out, I was like, I have so much <laughs> more money. <laughs> I went in to buy really stuff and clean. came out with more yeah. money. So I got free frozen yogurt and made money. And made money. That like, happened to us. Like our vending machine. The vending machine. When we went to go get my food out of the vending machine, there was already money in the little hole thing, yeah, right? There was already a, like a credit in there. Oh yeah. So we go to get chips and there's already money in or there's like a credit on the machine. So we use that, obviously, to get a bag of chips and then we got two bags of chips. We got two bags of chips they, and we made and, like a dollar fifty each. And made change somehow. It was the weirdest thing. It was a great day at work. Remember when we used to love work? Remember when we used to like being there? Yeah. He's like, I'm gonna eat these chickens. I'm gonna do it fast <laughs> because <laughs> I need to watch you. <laughs> he keeps looking at me. 
That's all you get because you're inhaling them and you're going to throw up. I'm not going to take your snacks. Pika. Wow. Come here. Come here, Rachel Franklin. Come here. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Look, just smell me. It's fine. He's like, ah, oh, so it is. <laughs> <laughs> Yet he's still going to bark I at me. I do not trust you. Oh, Pika. Pikachu. <laughs> Here's your indoor voice. Indoor voice. Come to Kim's place and you find limbs left over in places. <laughs> it's missing like, from me. your keychain. This guy. I love how instead of like taking it and throwing it in the garbage, you're like, it'll live here now. Yeah. Okay, so an arm over by Kim's light, and now we come out by the trash, and now here there's a head. It's like sculpted, like <laughs> it is a very stuff. well sculpted. Head. Someone, someone made it for someone and then they were like, I don't think I like That's this. That's someone's grandpa or something. We should put a plaque near it. <laughs> in memoriam or something. Yeah. That would be funny. So the car in front of us has one of those stick families on their window. And, oh no, get it quick, I'm not going to get it. Get it quick. I'm trying. And the little boy on the window is like holding a bra. It's Shit, there, yep. the candles. there go your candles. <laughs> so yeah, the stick family, the dad had like a briefcase and whatever, and the mom had like a bunch of shopping bags, the little girl was like a princess, and the little boy was holding a bra. Why? So I just got home from shopping with Kim. Well, not really, well I mean shopping, yes. I mean, went to the clinic, got my foot taken care of, got some medication. By the time I was done there, my day at work would have been over. I wasn't gonna turn around and go back, but anyways. So we went to uh, Bayshore, I picked up a couple pairs of shoes, one which I need to return, because this one thinks they're ugly and hates no, them. No, 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 hates no. them, and my thinks opinion, I look ugly in them. My opinion is that those boots are ugly and that they look bad on everyone because they're just not nice boots. But my opinion doesn't matter. Like it does! Wear. If you are wearing something that someone else thinks is ugly on you... Then punch them in the face! You said they looked terrible. So to me I that means not, they look said, terrible. I said, looked terrible in them. You said... I said you look, you looked ter or they looked terrible. What's I'm not Mizzou, they what's Mizzou playing with? What does he have? I don't know. But well, do you want to go get it before he chokes on it? It's a piece of plastic. I, not, I don't think you look terrible in them. It's a piece of plastic. Walk and them. talk at the same time. Your cat's going to choke. I don't think that you look terrible in them. I think that they don't look nice on you. She thinks it's weird because they've got that, it's a tall boot and they've got that bunched up style but and there's a all, seam really down bad. the middle. It's really bad because it's all spread out and like there's like three little bunches. It's a bunched bunches. up style. The other ones look a lot nicer because the bunches are actually together. The other ones I'm together. keeping no matter what because they're a completely different boot. They're a shorter boot Which and means? flat. They look just like my heeled boots, but they're flat. Pita pizzas for dinner again tonight because I didn't want to lose the pepperoni that I paid for. So, doing that, just put them in, and then I have to edit yesterday's video. I haven't done that yet. And I gotta take my medication for my foot. Hopefully that helps. Kim's actually picking me up tomorrow morning to go to uh, work because she knows how much pain I'm in. So she's gonna go in early and do like half an hour of overtime just to grab me so I don't have to walk to work tomorrow. So that's super nice. The loose grapes are amazing. All right, all right, keep an eye on those pizzas. <sighs> My work for tonight is done. The lunches are made. Kid is in the bathroom about to take her shower. Video is uploading as I speak, sort of, and I'm going to bed. When I say bed, I more mean like lay in my bed for like two hours till I eventually fall asleep. I'm hoping I fall asleep fast because I'm hoping I'm going to wake up tomorrow morning and my foot's going to be better because it's a really flipping sore right now. So, which is, it sucks, because yay, great, yeah, tomorrow's my Friday, which would mean, you know, Tuesday and Wednesday, which is my Saturday, Sunday, I could just, like, relax, stay off my foot. No, even tomorrow, I mean, I still have to go to the gym. I'm not going to not go to the gym just because my foot hurts. I'll just take it easy. And then Tuesday, I have to do my housework all day and go to the gym. <laughs> Wednesday, I could be able to stay off of it for most of the day, but then also going to the gym. So... Wednesday day I'll be able to relax my foot and then Thursday I'm back at work and so I don't know when I'm gonna give my foot time to get better hopefully soon but 
Anyways, I'm going to bed now. So, good night.